Hello folks, Boda Bob here. How y'all doing today? Hey, uh, just wanted to uh, share a little something I uh, been thinking about for a while, actually years, and been wanting to get it, and finally uh, took the uh, took the plunge and went ahead and purchased myself some uh, rolling toolbox. As you can see here beside me, I guess you already figured out what this video is about. It's about toolboxes. I'm going to tell you about the toolbox I chose to buy and why I bought it and then tell you a little bit about the features and um, a little bit about the product line. So I purchased these toolboxes from Harbor Freight. Harbor Freight has become a uh, go-to place for me. I'm not a professional mechanic, um, but I do like to turn a wrench or two and it's necessary. Um, when you live um, out in the country, you got to fix things. Things break and sometimes you uh, just need to get it done and turn the wrench yourself. So the toolbox I chose is from Harbor Freight. It's a US General brand. The toolboxes I chose are 26 by 22. That's 26 inches wide and 22 inches deep. So it comes the, with the roller chest, that's the bottom chest, it weighs in at 77 pounds, pretty heavy folks. And I also got a uh, top chest that weighs about 121 pounds. Now the roller chest will support a thousand pounds. So you gotta count the top chest on it and then also the weight of the bottom uh, cabinet. So approximately combined weight of the two cabinets is 300 pounds. So that means you can put 700 pounds of tools in these boxes and not worry about uh, destroying the boxes. I'm not aware of what the weight is per drawer. Um, there might be a little bit more information, but I don't see that information readily available in the um, marketing material I have here. So um, maybe a little research on your own. So. And speaking of marketing, I bought these with my own money. I'm not being paid or sponsored, or this isn't an affiliate um, with Harbor Freight. Um, I'm just telling you a little bit about what I bought and um, what I'm going to do. So the bottom, the roller chest or the roller cabinet comes with four wheels. Two of them are fixed. Two of them swivel. It has a handle on the side so that you can uh, push the cart around or the uh, cabinet around and then it has eight drawers and each drawer has a, a liner that comes with it pre-cut so that when you put your tools in there they don't move around on you and each cabinet has locks on it barrel locks and it comes with three keys for each and unfortunately the keys don't match so I don't understand that um, yeah, I'm a little disappointed with that, but you know, I understand why you can't do that, but it'd be nice if the um, keys matched. The one key to open both cabinets, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, the top chest also features an easy open lid. And um, so that's a little bit about the uh, overall um, information about the chest. So, let's just say I saved by using the coupons. I'm going to let you all figure the price out. I'm not going to talk about the price. But um, I saved $70 off of these by using the Harbor Freight coupons. You can get the coupons online. And I'll put links in the video for the, uh, for the coupons or where to look for the coupons. And uh, also links in there. The, these toolboxes come in different colors. Uh, I chose the orange. They match my Kubota tractor. And um, so that's kind of what I went with is uh, orange theme. Um, it's a very nice cabinet from what I've uh, found so far. I haven't put my tools in it yet. That's going to be a project for later today. And 
probably not going to videotape that, but because um, it'll just be too much to edit me putting my tools in the box. So, uh, what can I tell you about it? They're beautiful boxes. Oh, it comes in different colors. So, orange, yellow, green for you John Deere guys. They got a beautiful green color that'll go well with your John Deere tractor. They have a blue cabinet for your um, New Holland guys. They got a black one for the people that are uh, just like a plain ordinary black tool chest. What else do they have? They just got a multitude of colors. Black, orange, green, red. They also have red, Mahindra and RK. You'll like that. So just about every color, primary color that you could think of, uh, there's about six or seven, maybe eight different colors. Um, I think white is coming, but um, I don't think it's available on the tool chest yet. It is available in the uh, cart, the mechanics cart, but uh, not in the toolboxes yet. So, um, yeah, black, red, yellow, green, orange, and blue, I think are all the colors. I might have left one out, and I apologize if I did. So, yeah, folks, this is... Um, been a long time overdue for me and I'm glad I made the plunge and now I look forward to uh, taking all the small toolboxes I have around here and consolidating them into this big toolbox. Um, just a little information, the bottom toolbox has 5,700 cubic inches of storage and the bottom cabinet has 9,800 cubic inches of storage. So yeah, that's what um, what I, what I, uh, I know about these toolboxes. I'm gonna tell you folks, they are well constructed. Uh, before I purchased these, I went in and I looked at um, Craftsman toolboxes at the Lowe's. And just to say, the price on the Craftsman toolboxes were significantly higher. And they really, there were things about them that I didn't like, and I really can't go into it. You know, go in, pull the drawers open on a Craftsman. They're well built, they got good rollers on them, but there was something about them when they closed I didn't like. Um, same with opening them. I just didn't like it. And so, You'll have to go in and compare it. You know, this is a very, um, I don't want to say personal, but it's its a preference thing. So go into your uh, Lowe's where they sell Craftsman's branded uh, tool chests and check them out. See what you think. If you're willing to spend that kind of money for what they got and you like what they offer, go ahead and purchase those. But I, I'm not a professional mechanic and these tools are going to, you know, sit here and be organized in this tool chest for me and for the money that I spent um, it was under $500 for both of them I think that's a heck of a deal so check it out Harbor Freight US General you could buy them online I don't know what the shipping would be but you're probably gonna have to pay shipping or whatever so Go online, find the closest Harbor Freight to you, uh, and and see what they have to offer. See, uh, drive over there. I'll put a link in there uh, to help you get to uh, coupons. So let's just take a look at the toolbox here really quick. I'm gonna put these down so I don't knock them down. How you like my props? Real high tech here. So it's got this nice little lid. Not little, but you got an easy open lid. One thing I think it should have is, is a handle right there, but maybe not. Uh, it has channels here where you can put labels in. I'm probably going to use my label maker, but there's eight drawers on the top. There are seven wide drawers and three small drawers. This area here you could use for uh, 
putting sockets or other supplies, maybe uh, safety glasses, things like that. I also got some magnetic parts holders. The bottom has eight drawers. The bottom ones are deeper. I don't know if you can see the bottom ones. The bottoms are about five or six inches deep. The top ones are um, about an inch. Let's see, let's grab my tape. So the bottom roller cabinet has three inch and a half inch drawers. It has two, two and five eighth inch drawers. It's got one three and a half inch drawer and then two five and a half inch drawers. Two five and a half, one three and a half, two two and a half, three one and a half. Here it looks like on the top you got one two and three quarter inch or on the bottom of the top three no four one and a half inch drawers yep and then three of these smaller drawers that are only yeah they're an inch and a half inch deep also the top well is about three inches deep very nice has these hydraulic Action, hydraulic arms here to hold the lid up, won't fall on you and cut your hands off, break your wrists. Very nice, yeah, handles on the side. So, uh, yeah, Harbor Freight US General Toolboxes, I recommend them. So, once again, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Make a comment. Tell me if you uh, prefer a different uh, toolbox and what kind of toolbox you have and why you like it. Uh, give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and uh, come on back and watch another video with me. This is Boda Bob saying have a great day, guys. Cheers.